Can you help me with this? Can you help? Oh, there we go. I missed it. Oh, jeez. Why, why is it so hard? Nature. We're out in the woods. Man makes fire. You know, it's our taming fire. We've come a long way, haven't we? We sure baby? have. We've come a You've long come way. A long way, baby. Yeah, that was it. We've come a long that was a hit for you, wasn't it? That was a hit for me. Do you feel? Canadian, the Canadian romance. Don't forget the. Don't forget the. It's like the accent to go. Canadian romance. Oh, that's good. Bobby, we go back. All your songs are hits, are they not? You've written a lot of songs over the years. All my songs all hits. are hits. They're smoldering hits. How do I write a hit? Tell the viewers how I, not the, don't tell them how to write it. Tell me how to write it. Oh, right. How I personify it. I understand. I, it's funny because I knew there was something missing all along, and now I have it. I'm going to have as many hits as you from now on. Let me get a little wax. But uh, the question I have now that you've told me that is how do I make it distinctive? How do I make it my own? <laughs> I don't know if I can sacrifice myself to make all those hits my own. Well, you know what? Any hit that you write is gonna be your own hit. Well, I have to sacrifice Because that's myself. what copyright law is all about. No, you don't have to sacrifice anything. You just have to file, file, file for it. Every year? Yeah, every once year. Once a year? Well, not once a year. Just when you write the song, you file uh, your copyright and then and then, uh, you know, you get your... You've credit. claimed to be lots of things. What are you right now? Smoldering. <laughs> this is good. Are you spiritual? Are you a spiritual person? Is your music spiritual? Do you feel that the creation of your music is a spiritual thing? My music is... represents the inside of my brain, and it's a craggy, snaggy, wet and warm, sticky place, the inside of my brain. Um, but the brain is just one part, because when you make music, and when you make all great art, it comes from four places. The brain, the heart, the soul, and the, and the groin. The groin. I was wondering where you're going to get to the... Well, it's all connected. All the, four are connected. The, the penis. I felt tonight, you may, I heard music from your new album tonight. Can we show that? Yeah. This is a new album, Macaroni, which I... I'm going to give a little... There we go. I'm going to give a little smudge. That's good. Thank you for autographing your album with smoke. Now... Smoldering. Now all four are connected, so your music has that, but it's got more. I felt all four were more connected than ever tonight. The dick was connected. The dick well, bone the groin, connected. Could, whether you're man, woman, whatever. Yeah. You don't need a cock to rock. The dick you just bone need the and groin. the pussy bone were connected yeah. to the brain I I bone, to the eye. nose bone, finger bone. Well, maybe you can't articulate it properly, which <laughs> makes interviews a little difficult. But, uh, but uh, <coughs> what's the most Canadian? Working on a new cough. Let's hear it. <coughs> oh, I had it before. I can't do it again. It's sort of a, a weird, like, dead, like a dying like, child like a cough. <coughs> <laughs> oh, it came like it was a little softer. It was like a <laughs> that's it. This is good. Are you getting? Are you capturing this? Yeah, I think he's getting it. I think he's getting it. I've got it. I mean, <laughs> I think it's contagious. Let me just. <sighs> For you, if anyone's made it this far into the video, the record sounds nothing like this interview. We'll be editing it. Dan. Yeah, edit down to about to forty-five the, minutes. To about, yeah. That's about twenty-two minutes aside. Oh, awesome. Yeah. Oh, I want you. Ex can you do it in slow motion? So that's it. Oh man! Sometimes just getting through my day is like uh, walking through molasses. Uh, uh, 
What's the most Canadian song you've ever written? Uh, the Homeland? Um, no, that's that's about America. I yeah, know. yeah, I do. Okay. Uh, let me think. What's Canadian? I'm just grasping at straws right now. That's um, how I do interviews. Yeah, a lot of grasping. Yeah, really? Yeah, I'm grasping yeah. you. Um. If these questions are too hard, I can dumb them down a little. <laughs> yeah, dumb them down, man. They're really hard because none of the Kongs are Canadian. I, I'm not a, I'm not Canadian. Okay, let's way. let's not talk about your lack of Canadian identity. Yeah. What does your necklace mean? Oh, tell me about your necklace. This. <coughs> I meant the other one, but that's okay. Oh. Talk about this okay. one too. Okay. This is. Uh, yeah. This is the. It's a satanic town in Europe, no, isn't it? No, this is the great god Pan, uh -huh. the god of music, and this is made by my friend um, uh, Oliver Pfeiffer, who mm -hmm. is a, a German uh, jeweler, mm -hmm. and uh, I'm fortunate enough to actually have a jeweler. It's weird. I don't even like jewelry, but he makes things for us because he's a he likes our music. This is the town symbol of Schorndorf in Germany, in Bavaria. It's a satanic town. It is it? a satanic town. It's a town based on the worship of Satan. It's real. It's real. It's not. I'm not fucking with you. Do they all get real, along there? They get along great. It's beautiful. Yeah. Um, Have you been there? Yeah, we went there and we saw this this symbol everywhere. We we're like, oh shit, yeah, the Satan. Do they all look so, like uh, Anton LaVey, Shane no, Jackson, Goatees, even look, the women? No, they look okay. as normal as you, well, they look n more yeah. normal than you. But anyway, they look they look totally, uh, you know, like typical Germans. And um, and then this is, uh, this says Lehman Brothers, I don't know mm -hmm. if you can see this, but sort of like, you know, OG original gangster Oshkosh, style. Oshkosh, bagosh. Yeah, original gangster style. Um, uh, investment bank that you know created this tree. Isn't this great to be here with it nature is. and in the woods? Thanks for and coming. Not, Thanks and for out of coming. the city. Thanks for taking me out of the city. It's good to come to Canada to and explore nature, isn't it? <coughs> What's your favorite part of exploring I, nature? It just seems like shouldn't we? I mean, since we're in Banff, shouldn't we like go hiking or something? Let's go for a hike. Yeah. Is there anything else you want to say? Uh, I love you. I love the Canadian I love you romantic. Too. I want more Canadian romantic. I want to. Well, you just made another episode just by being here, isn't it? You just you just helped create more of the Canadian romantic. I'm sorry that I'm so sleepy. Oh, and it's been a long morning. It it has been. God, that fucking hike this morning, Jesus oh. Christ! But the pancakes we, you made were delicious. Oh, thank you, thank you. Here in Canada, we call them pancakes. <laughs> In America, we call them flapjacks. See, we're funny that way, aren't we? <laughs> Cold camping in that skimpy outfit? You know what? There's a fire inside. <laughs> oh, God. There's a fire burning in me. You look cold. No, no. You look cold and silly. Your nipple is erect. <laughs> You're silly. See that? You're being silly on this camping trip. I'm going to make a mark with yeah. a stick on your belly. Make a mark on my belly. There we go. Here, because it's a happy belly. A lot of good, yummy food has gone in that belly. There. Flapjacks. Pancakes. Thank you, America. Tomato, tomato. Thank you, Canada. Potato, potato. Let's call the whole thing off. I think we're through.